The band we are talking about tonight is celebrated. One, two, one, two. Not a single band in the world, not a single band leader in the world makes the past come alive as well as Vince Giordano and the Nighthawks. Now, Dinah, is there anyone finer? The state of Carolina, is there reason you know her? Show her to me, Dinah. Dixie eyes blazing, love sitting, gazing, eyes of Dinah Lee. Prohibition! This is the best band I've ever played in. It's the most important band I've ever played in. And it's about the most important thing in my life right now. Because I'm around people that are stupendous musicians, people that for decades I would have been happy to carry their case. And suddenly I'm sitting next to them. So that's why it, it all comes back to playing with Vince. And I'm spoiled for life because I'll probably never play with another band that does this better. Folks, thanks so much. Vince is the experience that you would have heard if you were lucky enough to have been alive to go hear this music live at its inception. Down in Georgia, there's a dance that do. Ain't nothing to it. It's easy to do. Call Shake That Thing. Oh, shake that thing. Oh, shake that thing. Oh, shake that thing. I'm getting tired of telling you to shake that thing. It ain't no chalk, no pigeon wing. Man, it's easy to do. Call Shake That Thing. Oh, shake that thing. Oh, shake that thing. Oh, shake that thing. When I first met him, I thought he was very unusual and a nice person, but I didn't think he was like exceptional, crazy like he is. <laughs> but it wasn't until I came to see his house and saw all the filing cabinets, I was just afraid, like, oh my gosh, this guy is eccentric. Over the years, I had started to pick up what they call stock arrangements. Now, I have over 60,000 arrangements. So let's say you took 25 arrangements to every gig that you did from now until the end of your career. Would you ever get through the collection? No, no, it's that, it's that much music I have here. It's more music than many lifetimes to play. You gotta be crazy to wanna start a jazz band and to keep them working. So, I mean, if Vince acts crazy, I'm saying, well, you know, of course he's crazy. He's, he's the band leader. And as he says, a day without chest pains is a day without sunshine. One, two, three. Being a big band leader is sort of a recipe for going nuts, you know, because it's just really a lot to deal with. And Vince has been trying at least to lead his big band for well over 30 years. Here you go. That's a longevity that I can't think of anyone to compare with except maybe Duke Ellington. This is what the man does. He collects arrangements, he brings them to the band, he keeps his orchestra working, and this is the music that he loves. It's just like Louis Armstrong. At the end of the 40s, jazz went into bebop and more modern forms of jazz. But he just said, whatever, I know who I am. Thank you, thank you. How about those great dancers? How about these wonderful musicians? What a night, what a night.